Thanks again, man, for helping me. No problem, man. What are friends for? Dude, it takes me forever. Yeah. So where are you uh, taking all this stuff? Downtown. Huh? Yeah, it's kind of crowded right now because they're filming the Hunger Games. Oh, yeah, I heard about that. Yeah. Did you know uh, Aaron is actually going to be an extra in that? Really? Yeah, he does a lot of extra work. Like, he's in um, The Walking Dead the Walking not too long Dead. ago. Yeah. yeah. All right. If the Hunger Games were real. Yeah, I would win. You would win the Hunger Games. I would win the Hunger Games. You would, how, how would you win the Hunger Games? Right. Tell me. You remember Peter? Peter, yes, I remember Peter. Whatever. All right. You know how... So where are you going to hide? All right. Peter had the right idea. Hide the whole time. It's smart. But the only problem with his plan, he hit on land. That's stupid. Someone's going to find you eventually. Yeah, you could get stepped on. What I would do, I would take it to the next level. I would build a contraption out of bark, seaweed, and mud. Make it into a cylinder that will allow me to breathe underwater. What would you do about food, though? All right. I'm glad you asked that. I've been watching the Discovery Channel a lot recently, almost too much. What I'm going to do is I'm going to use the hunting tactics of the flathead fish. The, the what fish? Flathead fish. You don't know the flathead fish? Oh my gosh. All right. The flathead fish, what he does, he buries himself under the sand in the ocean. While the fish are swimming around, he's hunting them the whole time. They don't even know it because they're stupid because they're fish. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to bury myself under the sand in the ocean using my contraption that allows me to breathe underwater. And while everyone's getting killed, girls dying, their heads getting chopped off by other dudes, I'm going to be living under the water. And when the fish comes around, I'm going to snatch it and I'm going to eat it. I'm not going to cook it because that means I got to go on the land. Make a fire, and it's going to give my position away. So no, I'm going to eat it raw. I feel like you've given this a lot of thought. I have thought this out many, many times. Because the Hunger Games, it's going to happen eventually. All right, see, this is what I would do. If I was in the Hunger Games, I would just go Rambo all over the tributes, okay? I would cover myself in mud like Arnold Schwarzenegger did in Predator, so he's kind of blended in. And at night, when they're least expecting it, I'll just come up behind them and just kill them all. And as I'm just like murdering them all down with my glistening muscles in the sun, beautifully, Katniss would be like, oh man, it's beautiful, amazing. And she would just be all over me, like Sesame Seed on Bun. Glistening muscles? Yeah, man, glistening muscles, you know? You just compared yourself to Arnold Schwarzenegger and Sylvester Stallone. You are nowhere near their muscle mass. What? I mean, okay, maybe not, you know, a little off, a little bit. A little? Dude, you're way off, okay? No, no, okay. You're more like the guy from Social Network. Curly hair? Who's in Zombieland? Oh. He's gonna be new Lex Luthor in Superman. Jesse Eisenberg? Yeah. That guy, that string bean? Okay, maybe not, okay, maybe not Arnold big, but you know, more like. More like Christian Bale when he was doing Batman, where he was like still big but lean, you know, with his no, muscle no, physique. No, no, you're not Batman at all. Well, I'll give you Christian Batman. Bale. I'll give you Christian Bale. Well, maybe like Mirror Cycle, right? No. All right, you're mechanist, Christian Bale. The machinist? Man, he had like no muscle mass. He was skinny. He was walking around like a skeleton. Come on, I clearly you're not seeing what I'm seeing. Clearly, you're not seeing what I'm seeing. Look in a freaking mirror. All right, okay, maybe we need another opinion here. We do need a third party opinion. Ted, what do you think? What do you think, Ted? I think I should let me go. Shut up, Ted, you don't know anything. Yeah, you're not smart. Yeah, that's what you're getting robbed, idiot. Nerd. Not geek. <laughs> Crippled. Oh, why would you say that? Dude, that's not cool, man. Yeah, that's not cool, man. Yeah, the poor man, yeah. Well, I thought we were yeah, insulting him. Point that out, though. All right, you know, you know let's try it again. Let's try it again. Let's try it again. All, All right, right. um. Nerd. You already said that. You already said that. Oh. You know, should, let's, let's you know, move we'll past. move past it. We'll let's, come back to it. Let's, let's get just, this stuff and leave. Yeah, let's get out of here. Bye. See you, Ted!